How's it going, everybody? February 25th, Merch by Amazon sales update. Finally, some excitement. Uh, there's a couple of things that have happened over the last couple of days, and, and yesterday just really, I just kind of blew everything away. Uh, these are my US sales yesterday. As you can see, like this chart here is just, it, it doesn't make any sense, right? Uh, and I'll talk about this in a little bit, but it's not just one product. There, there's something that happened a couple of days ago, in addition to one of my products starting to sell a lot more, uh, that's, that's made uh, this huge change. Right now, it's not even 11 in the morning, and I already have 11 sales, nine in the US, as you can see here, and that's after a pretty exceptional day of 23 in the US, and get this, 31 total sales yesterday. 31 total sales yesterday, and just what, one, two, three, four, five days ago, I had one sale in the US. Now let's talk about this for a second. The, the products that, that sold, so look at it, 23, there's one product that's taking off clearly here, 12, 12 sales. But then in addition to that, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, actually, hold on, I lost track here. Let's do it, let's do it from the bottom. 12 unique products, so that, that does the math for me, 11. In addition to this product, there were 11 other sales that I made. So if we take this out of the equation, it's still a pretty, pretty impressive day comparing to the, the last two months. So here's kind of what I'm thinking. Yes, this happened. There's one product that, that's clearly taking off. Even like I said, today uh, before 11 a.m., I've made six sales of that one product. But here's what's interesting to me is that 11 other products sold the same day. I think, and, and I think, pretty like this is kind of like well known but but it's it's just funny to me how much influence this makes but when amazon shows more of your products to their customers that's when these kinds of sales are possible and i've seen this with ebay for example where it's it's as if ebay and amazon push certain products to certain areas like geographical areas uh, and and I've seen eBay for example like one day I'll make three four sales and they're all from like Puerto Rico I'll make five sales from just California where you know on any other random day I'll I'll make like three sales from all over the place all over the world right which is like what why was you know Puerto Rico targeted that one day and I think this is what's I don't know what's happened but there's no way that after one product takes off that 11 others sell when they weren't selling for the last couple of months so in my opinion whatever amazon was doing right now i'm in a position where they're showing more of my products where they're getting them in front of the customers because these are not products that i listed yesterday you know these are products that have been sitting around for a while like some of them are newer uploads but these products have been available for sale for a while and now all of a sudden you know they're all starting to sell so that just makes me think that for whatever reason my products were not available for sale to that extent now let's talk about this a couple of days ago i think it was like here or here i was thinking i was wondering if i was going to crack 110 look at the change over one day when you have crappy sales like you get 30 sales in one day and now you're beating your previous month uh my my monthly total let's let's just actually look at last month first so for january i had 177 total sales this month so far because of the last couple of days 230 look at this first time i think i've cracked 100 uh, euros of royalties uh, for any other marketplace than the U.S. So now look at these look at these 
uh, profits. They, they're really adding up to the point where, you know, February started out a terrible month, has turned out into a pretty solid month. And especially, you know, I understand it's a short month and then the, today is the 25th and uh, what do we have today and three additional days. So we have four days left. Uh, money will just keep adding up, especially if it continues like this. Like, for example, to have nine sales before 11 a.m. Uh, was so rare for me since since November uh, that, that it didn't simply happen. I actually wanted to pull this up, and I'll probably put this in the title too, but I, I did this before I started uh, recording. But look at this. February, January, December. I actually had to go all the way back to the beginning of November to find a day that was better than yesterday. And it was uh, right here. I think one of these days total sales were were over uh, 35. Actually, I, I might even have to go back uh, earlier, but I think it's actually this one. So p potentially beginning of, of November of 2021, but it looks like it actually might be uh, October. So yesterday was the best month, best day in about three or four months. And ba basically what I'm trying to say is it, it's definitely not, you know, because my products were not available. I truly believe that that Amazon has so much control over which products are, are pushed in front of our customers that, that, you know, we actually sometimes forget how little control we have here. And it's great that, you know, one of my products is taking off. But again, to get an additional 11 and, and you know, in one day and comparing it to days like this is just, just amazing. So I hope this trend continues. I have no idea what's going to happen. You know, today is Friday, uh, but we'll see how this weekend goes. I've been in situations where this has happened before. And it lasts, you know, three, four days and the sales just simply drop back down to like two or three. I hope that doesn't happen. But again, I'll, I'll take any kind of profits or anything that, that, you know, comes in that's a little extra. And talking about profits, I actually uh, didn't, didn't look into this. But in the U.S. yesterday, uh, I made $444.73 in sales for the total of $82.00 in royalties amazing almost like almost a hundred dollars just in the US and let's look at that let's look at uh, profits for yesterday so if we're looking at uh, I'll do like a quick uh, conversion here so let's say this is like 20 euros it's a little more uh, let's say 25 so about 30 bucks let's say the fair estimate it's probably like 27 to 30 bucks uh, but yesterday in royalties I made a hundred and ten dollars around there just one day but I remember a couple of days ago I was doing an update you know where uh, I was kind of saying if I hit $300 in royalties that I'll be you know that, that would be perfect because at least it's beating January and now it's like so far away from from January you know with three days left to go so anyways that's kind of where I am it's exciting uh, and it just kind of tells you what, what, what I kept saying is don't give up you know, this kind of stuff happens. It's so crappy. Uh, but again, if, if the worst case scenario for my account, for example, we're talking like the worst month in over, you know, two or three years, I'm still getting a $600 uh, check, you know, making $600 in royalties and profits, I'll take it. And, uh, you know, anything it, 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 like anything better than that is just exceptional. So, you know, hopefully I get a few more months this year that, that crack a thousand two two thousand dollars in royalties uh, but but the way that this is kind of uh, the direction it's going in right now I'm, I'm happy about so anyways best day in about three four months awesome I'll talk to you guys later